The power grids in Denmark and Norway are connected via the four links over Skagrak, bringing 1700 megawatts of renewable energy to both countries' energy mix. In the end of July, one of the cables, the Skagrak 2, was damaged due to external impact. In 1977, the cable system between Kristiansand in Norway and Sjæla in Denmark was installed and buried in the sandy seabed. At the damaged site, approximately 36 kilometers north of Bolbjerg in Denmark, a section of hard seabed had left some 40 meters of the cable exposed. After an initial investigation and fault location, Statnet reached out to NKT in September 2017 with a request to do a turnkey repair on the 250 kilovolt mass impregnated high voltage direct current HVDC cable system. Time was of the essence to get the link restored, but at this time of the year, the sea can be very unpredictable and rough. NKT has an extensive track record of high voltage cable service solutions and with NKT Victoria, the world's most advanced cable laying vessel, we have the capabilities to operate in demanding conditions and provide optimum efficiency, accuracy and safety to any submarine cable operation. The planning was thorough and required close cooperation between the customer and the technical marine and operational experts. The marine repair plan was set up and included a detailed marine survey and a QHSE plan. NKT's technical engineering department made the cable and joint analyses in order to maintain the cable integrity during the repair, which is included in the cable handling procedures required on NKT Victoria to perform a safe and efficient operation. After loading the spare cable on board NKT Victoria in Drammen, Norway, the vessel set course to the fault location close to Denmark to perform its first cable repair operation. When arriving at the site, the experienced service team could start without delay. As the weather got worse, a steady position was maintained by NKT Victoria's dynamic positioning system, DP3. The high-precision operation of jointing the spare cable and original cable together was time-optimized with the support of the marine advisory system. Finally, the cable system was overboarded using a quadrant and laid in the planned position on the seabed with the highest accuracy. The NKT Turnkey Cable Service Project finished and the Skagerak 2 cable link was once again back in operation and bringing power to life.